There was a time when I was using the Hobonichi Weeks and I actually really, really enjoyed it. Um, I actually prefer the Mega Weeks over the regular Weeks and I believe this is one that was gifted to me. I originally bought for 2020 the Weeks that was not Mega and it was like the hardcover. I won't ever do that again because with the soft cover, you can kind of put this into the flap of any leather covers you use or whatever. So I was using it um, religiously for a while there in the beginning of the year, but um, quickly the Hobonichi week starts to become really small for me. And um, this is ideal for when you're out kind of doing your own thing and you're like traveling a lot maybe or for work in my opinion that's kind of what I used it for in the past but I thought I would do a flip through just to show some of the planners that I have used um the weeks and the next one I'll show you these are kind of like my on the go carries in my purse they f they're very slim line they can fit really nicely in there so I would like to use the weeks like so in my mind, but it always turns into like this. And so I love this. I love the way it looks, honestly, but it's not enough space, honestly, for me. If I have a multiple events that day, um, it's kind of hard to track that. It's, it's very, it's, it's wonderful. It's very versatile, I, get, I think, because you can block washi off and then journal in here if you really wanted to. So this was one of my favorite pages. Really, really loved it. So as you could see, the weeks kind of dwindled down. I stopped, what, in March? I tried to pick up again in June. Mm, as you could see, it just didn't do anything for me. <laughs> So, I mean, I could use it if I want to still, if I ever get that wild hair, but nah. um, I, I don't know if I'll buy one next year. I always say I won't, but I end up doing. So these are the note pages. I was just using it like bullet journaling, kind of what I use my commonplace book now. So I have a whole bunch of pages. I also was liking to work my way from the back to the front. And so I did that. I did like all of these were scripture right here. And I started what in March. So I did scripture writing plans. I did a tab that says scripture. And then it was to account all the way up until October. And then I just did like notes from the back to the front. So, I mean, you can make almost anything work, in my opinion. I really, really thought it, it was cute. Sometimes I'll pull it out and put it in my purse, but right now I have a Steology in my purse that's cut down to the weak size. It's just blank paper. Just a sec. <laughs> I had to put some nasal spray. I don't know. I guess my allergies are kicking my butt this morning. So here is this. When I film this, I get a lot of questions. So look at the back. <laughs> I had cut it down some like up to like right here to fit another notebook i think it was i don't know whatever but i got sticker paper and covered the back you still have to cut it down some to fit this cover it is the um this is a d-ringed filofax in the pocket this is not how i i mean i didn't do this myself clearly you guys know that I am not that clean when it comes to my planners. I like, when I do ring them, I like cut them out. <laughs> but 
Um, this is one that I probably will get next year. Slides perfect in the back. I used more sticker paper because I tore up the front somehow. And all it is is just an image on here with more sticker paper. And I kind of glued it to the, well, the sticker paper. I covered it to the side. And I've used this thing for a lot of different things, honestly. Um, this is a 2019. So I have used a lot as a bullet journal. Notes, when I was working a lot, I used this as my everyday carry. Um, leadership meeting notes. I was in HR. I was an HR manager. So, um... I mean, I used it like on the go, stuff I needed to do. I tipped in stuff, used it for like, I mean, everything, guys. And then in the beginning, let me see, I was using it. I'll quickly go through them. I was, it was definitely working out. This is, I think, the Sarasa pen on these pages. And this is the Moleskine Daily in the... Is it the small, what do they call it, pocket? I don't know. Journal, HR social. So, our divisions. I really loved his podcast because I would pull it out from my purse in the morning and I would use it as like a brain dump before my day at work got started. Um, if you missed it, I quit my job in March 2019 to take care of my daughter full time. I do miss HR sometimes. That's what I've known. I've been in HR for about 11 years, 12 years. So that's all I know. But, um, yeah. I wouldn't want to work right now, honestly. <laughs> so as I started to go through, here's when I started to use it in January. So I just cover up the dates and do the same thing. Now, I was using it for like day specific in May last year. So, or this year rather, I think. So I started covering it up. So I have a whole bunch of life left here. So I will definitely finish this, but this is exactly how I had it with this pin. Um... It is so freaking cute. I don't think I bought this. I think someone gifted it to me again. I mean, y'all are wonderful, for real. And how you treat me, just wonderful. So, you got more stickers that I'm finding. I, I like to get my stickers in there, as you can see, because when I want to use this, I take the pen out, because I'm using the pen right now, but Right here, I don't know, I think I have these cute little doll looking girls. I put them on the daily pages when I'm using this notebook. Um, I got those at the little craft store, just um, business card and stickers. My business card, my husband's no longer with Keller. So, and then more. You guys know I just love stickers. Because I do a lot of daily in here. And then you know the Malden is just a beautiful piece of work. And then more here. So again, when I use this, I'm already like, I've got more stickers here. <laughs> and here. So I love this thing. I would definitely use these two again if um, for my purse when I'm out and about, but that's kind of what I've used them for before. So I just wanted to show you. If you have any questions, let me know. God bless you.